I prefer a Minnesota fillet knife. Convincing a middle schooler to do anything. And if you're from Minnesota, you know. It's difficult. For this one, I just carved the inside there. Convincing them to eat their fruits and vegetables. It's a challenge every day. A reach. For them to take fruits and vegetables. For the stars. One second here. But Connie Sarn isn't a lunch lady who gives up. Carrot, radish. Never on the kids. And a blueberry. I have been at John Glenn for 10 years but I've been in the school district since 1998. More than two decades of experience has taught her. <laughs> it's gonna be an owl. Improvise, adapt. There's the beak. And overcome. So after all, her creativity. So he has wings also. Is as colorful as the rainbow of foods she promotes. I use a lot of toothpicks. So she carves away. There's his feet. I started out on day one and did a simple little frog in the salad bar and then I was hooked. A treat for the eyes to show that yes, a healthy diet can be a treat for the stomach too. As I go, it gets more complicated. Her elaborate fruit creations. Radishes are my favorite. A little nudge a kid might need. I put jicama in certain things um, that were out there one day and a kid asked, told me he was gonna try the jicama. So, you know, maybe, you hope so. That was my first all, yeah. For 35 school days. I upped the any that day, it was a Friday, so I had done it all week. Sarn has devoted her time outside of school to bring a little bit of whimsy to the students at John Glenn Middle School. A girl asked me yesterday if I could do a squid. This lunch lady. I said I could try, sure. Likes investing in the kids who live around her. They all live here somewhere. You know, they're all in my neighborhood and and I see them all over the community. It's really fun to see the smiles on the kids' faces when they talk about it or they're excited about it. It's fun to see kids excited about something really simple, you know, as a sculpture that you made. And I guess that's probably why I keep doing it. It's fun to see their excitement over it. And this is our amazing salad bar for today, which is, this is what it looks like every day. And every child deserves a balanced meal. Fresh everything. With a side of love. You could really eat all these if you watched out for the toothpicks. <laughs> in Maplewood. Oh, uh oh, you see a toothpick? Sharing you. <laughs> Carol 11 News. Connie, you're so awesome. You, ah, and you have a photo album with real photos in it and pages and stuff. That's fantastic. It's so much better than Instagram. Anyway, it's going to be spring break soon. So Connie says she's going to get a break from creating, but just kidding. She's going to continue doing her carving until her co-workers or students get tired of it when she gets back or until her husband, get this, until he gets tired of eating stir fry with the leftover carvings. Fantastic owl stir fry. Connie, you're great. We'll be right back.